Hello, and welcome to your Reiki session. Uh, for tonight's Reiki healing session, energy healing, we're going to be working with the intention of cutting cords and releasing energetic ties to unwanted energy, unwanted people, experiences, just giving ourselves this little space to be more intentional and let go and release ourselves um, from things that perhaps are holding us back. So I'm going to use a few tools, but there'll be a lot of um, plucking and ASMR and tapping and things like that throughout, okay? And I wanted to show you the tools that I would use throughout. Um, this is a piece of black kyanite, and it kind of is like in a blade formation. And black kyanite is so um, kind of cleansing, feels like it can kind of get to the root of something and pull it out from there. So using this as a little um, kind of tool to cut um, and pull and pluck energetic cords. And after that, I have this um, little hand-forged tool. It's not sharp at all, but um, feels really interesting. So using this again to cut cords, release energetic ties between us and unwanted energy. And lastly, I'm going to close out with a feather. I've been using this quite a bit recently to just um, cleanse and clear energy. It feels really soft and gentle. Um, so using this to release unwanted energy ties, same as the others, but it feels a little lighter. And I'm just going to start us off by channeling some Reiki. Starting to open up your energy and center you in this space, bringing you into alignment with this energy work, centering you here, bringing you present. And perhaps taking a few deep breaths Deep breaths in, long exhale out. And starting to bring your focus to this energy healing. Bringing your focus to your intention to release. Allowing yourself to open to the experience. to surrender and release energy and energetic cords. going to start off with the black kyanite. This is not a particularly um, nice specimen. It's a little rusty from all the iron in it. So starting to open up your energy. And finding those energetic cords. Attach you to unwanted energy and snipping them away.
just cutting their attachment, allowing them to be released. your connections to unwanted people, unwanted places, unwanted experiences. And calling that energy back to you, bringing it home You can always pick these items back up again, but for now we're just letting our attachments to them drop away, putting down that weight. And as I'm pulling through, releasing those energetic attachments, perhaps thinking of those things you wish to release, holding them in your mind, in your body for a moment, and then allowing yourself to feel it draining away. Allow it to be released from the body pulled, plucked, or just draining out, whichever works best in your mind, whichever feels right, but allowing it to release so that what is left behind is just you, pure, open, receptive. Using this to pull some deeper items. We're trying to release anything connected to that situation or person. Pulling out those deeper attachments. Allowing yourself to feel your burden being released.
That is some black kyanite and a natural blade of it. Oops, I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of rusty. There's a lot of iron in it. And it's pretty fragile. But very protective and grounding and cleansing. So I'm going to bring in this little tool, which is not sharp at all. It's kind of just hammered um, iron, I believe. Steel. <laughs> I always forget. But handmade and hand pounded piece of metal. I'm using this to help us Go a little deeper into your energy, releasing energetic ties deeper within, a little bit closer to the heart, being gentle and careful, allowing ourselves to put down these energetic connections, be at peace for a moment. Have some calm and clarity and then we can decide what to allow back in. And calling back your power, calling back your energy, Allowing yourself to reabsorb what's coming back to you. Integrating it into your energy field. Okay, I'm going to do some more slits to release, little cuts. Just dragging down, allowing those to drop away. Releasing your end. And calling in your power again. Allowing yourself to be filled up with your energy.
few more. Going deep to the center of what we're releasing. Finding its core, finding its center, and allowing the root of it to be released. So I was using that tool, a piece of hand-forged metal. Sorry, my cat joined me. One moment. Sorry, this is your moment of kitty purrs. Close this out with um, a feather and just using this to lightly just pull and pluck and release some of the lighter stuff. Um, anything sort of sweeping up after you cut your hair, um, getting all the little bits that might be stuck in your energy as we just opened and cleansed out. So sweeping away.
just letting that all go, letting it be swept away, the last little traces, leaving you feeling light and open, unburdened, free. We want to be open and receptive to new connections that support and help us. And so we don't want our energy to close down. We want our energy to feel open, free. That energy feels much better. Okay, sorry, my cat is really insistent on being in this video, so if you can hear her purring. Um, yeah, she really wanted to be here for this, so. <laughs> um, thank you so much for trusting your energy in this space, and I hope that we were able to symbolically release some energy from your energy field, from your life, from your mind, all of that, so. Um, it is my hope that this was helpful for you. Um, yeah, thank you so much for being here. If you enjoyed this session, please subscribe and comment below. And um, here are some of the ways that you can support my channel. But thank you so much for being here and I will see you in the next one.